Welcome to the battlefield, my warriors. This is Darkson of Legend playing uh, Storm 3 Full Burst for you again today. Um, I have a very short video for you guys today. I'm planning on showing you guys the backgrounds. Not sure if you're interested, but even if you aren't, stick around for the end because I have a very important but short announcement. Uh, but anyway, basically the challenge mission mode is new to Full Burst and it's included in both retail and DLC. It has 100 missions, and every time you complete a set of 10, which is ranked by difficulty, then you unlock a uh, image. Every time you complete a mission within a set, it unlocks a part of the image, and then once you complete the whole thing, it comes out full. Um, the stars you may see there are extra requirements, not necessary to complete the mission, but do make it harder to complete. Um, and if you complete every single star from all 100 missions, uh, then you unlock a very special background that I will also show you. Um, so anyway, the first one here is this awesome one. <laughs> I like it a lot. Um, and it's basically an altered, slightly altered uh, version of the game cover. This one is a nice little uh, setup of uh, the characters, the, the main characters from um, the Nine Tails Attack while Naruto is being born. This one is of Naruto versus Sasuke for uh, this time, for, in this game, the third time. This one is of Naruto and his parents. I've grown really, really fond of this picture, so I will probably be using this as a background at some point. And if you guys are wondering which, what I am using, I will tell you once we see it. And this one is of Naruto and his Ninetales nine cloak, sorry, um, with uh, most of his friends in the background with their war uniforms. This one is of Kakashi with the Seven Ninja Swordsman in the background. <laughs> Very fitting. This one is of the Five Kage facing Madara, with uh, Madara looming nicely in the background with his Susanoo and Meteorites. This one is of uh, Toby with the Tailed Beasts. And for those of you that um, know Toby's true identity, do not spoil it, um, because I'm trying to take into account people that have not read the manga yet, um, and since the, the, his identity was not revealed in this game, I am waiting to talk about that until the next game is released. This one is of Naruto releasing Kurama, the Nine Tails, and uh, yeah, <laughs> pretty nice. This one is of uh, Naruto and uh, Tobi, uh, staring at each other on Miss Rubble, and it's kind of like comic booky with that little divider there. Um, a lot of these images are nice, some of them I'm not really sure if I'm going to use as backgrounds though, but you know, we'll see. Anyway, uh, as you can see down there, triangle, rare image list, there are two of those. Um, the first one is this. You get uh, a piece of this image every time you complete a set of 10, and then when you complete all 100 missions you get this, which I think is a nice image and also very fitting for the DLC of Full Burst. Uh, but the one I am using, and the last one, uh, not not consequentially, but I'm using this one. Um, it's a really nice, like, filtery, old-timey kind of picture of uh, the first Hokage fighting Madara with the uh, Ninetales. And um, the reason I am using this one is just because I think it looks the coolest, which is probably what they were trying to go for with making this the hardest one to get. Um, but to be honest with you guys, I think that the... Uh, who think like which image is cooler to people depends on the person and I will definitely be switching out these themes as time goes on um, but this is the one I'm using right now and this is the one you get for getting all 100 stars which actually for the most part is pretty easy but when you get into the eight or nine uh, ninth row then it starts getting pretty difficult um, but anyway so those are the images went on went on a lot longer than I wanted it to um, but here's the short announcement. Um, basically, I ordered my headphones. If you guys uh, have known or if you didn't know, a uh, quick recap. I ordered new headphones um, that I could actually, you know, use with my PlayStation. I ordered a, a PlayStation Official Pulse a wireless headset um, with a USB. Thought it would solve my problems. For some reason, was not compatible at all with the Elgato. So uh, after figuring out the problem and calling PlayStation support and going on the Elgato forum, I found a list of people that, are, I mean, uh, a list of uh, headsets that were definitely compatible with the Elgato. 
Only two of them were on that list, and I made a video trying to ask people for suggestions if they had any more, but uh, I decided to go with one of the uh, headsets on the list. It's uh, called the Triton AX180. I ordered it, and it should be here on Friday. Um, I am going to be gone, like, away from my home from Wednesday, tomorrow, on through Friday. Not sure if I'm going to be getting a home Friday morning or Friday night, but I will be coming back either Friday afternoon or Saturday. And then we will start off with a bang with Batman, and then try to get into the other Let's Plays like Last of Us, Kingdom Hearts, you know. Um, and then that's that. The last thing I wanted to say is that the PlayStation 4 is coming out November 15th. I'm going to try to get it as uh, soon as I can, and I did pre-order it, so it should be, you know, there should be a copy reserved for me. The um, crazy people shouldn't uh, be able to get their hands on it. But um, I'm not going to be recording it right away. First of all, there's no guarantee that the Elgato will work with PS4. We're going to have to see about that. But if it, even if it does, I want to complete the Let's Plays I'm currently doing on the PS3 before moving on to PS4. And I'm not going to completely abandon the PS3, I do want to go back because there are plenty more games that I haven't even gotten to play yet that I want to. Um, and the PS4 is going to be a relatively new system, uh, so I'm going to, you know, have to collect games uh, slowly as I go on. But I wanted to at least complete Batman, The Last of Us, Kingdom Hearts, and Storm 2 before moving on to PS4. So that's it. Sorry I, this video took a lot longer than I wanted it to. Um, Jersey Boys um, background videos usually take like a minute, <laughs> so sorry. Um, anyway, if you guys like the video, leave a comment, like, and subscribe. Thanks for watching, guys, and I will see you next time.